I'm no, I'm no hero. I'm not, I'm not bandstanding. I just figured, you know, maybe if I went out, you know, I, I, I'm not afraid to be sick anymore and I'm not afraid to be disabled. And that was really hard. Yeah. So I was ashamed. I was embarrassed. I felt guilty. And, uh, once I crossed that bridge, I realized I don't have to be scared anymore, you know, and I don't advocate everybody with a vestibular disorder or any disability to do something that's beyond what they can do. I don't, I'm not an advocate for exercise. You know, if you have a disability and you do rehab, you have to do that. But I don't believe, I, I believe everybody with a disability has to take their own road and it has to be a road they're comfortable with. And I found a road that I was comfortable with and it just so happened that people paid attention when I started getting into the public eye a little bit more and it gave hope. And that was my whole goal. It wasn't to motivate people to go out and do what I'm doing. It was to motivate people to do something that gives them hope. You know, if you're a painter and you lost painting, if you can get back to painting, it might, maybe that'll help. It's just simple things, simple things in life when you have a disability are huge.